Hey, so I was gonna make a video like I normally do on the city of Budva, um, possibly where the uh, beer comes from, but I can't find anyone that can actually tell me this or not, because when the uh, Czech Republic, or Czechoslovakia, used to be an entire country, then this would have incorporated it, and this, this place is called Budva. Um, so instead of doing the usual, I'm gonna show you around the city, uh, the reason I didn't is because I didn't take my camera with me. Um, that is because I went down to the beach. Um, and when you're traveling solo, you don't really want to keep valuables on you. So I just took bare minimum, a little bit, some notes, uh, swimming shorts, and headed down to the beach. Um, I did tour around the city quite substantially because as soon as I got to the beach, uh, I realized this beach is very stony, uh, incredibly crowded. Uh, if you can picture Odessa in Ukraine, the sort of, you know, the rundownness of it, it you, you, and then make the place busier, this is Budva. Uh, lots of Russian tourists, uh, lots, of Montene lots, lots of Serbians, uh, lots of people from former Yugoslavia around here. Um, observations while I've been here. Um, the food is really bad. This Montenegro generally, the food is really bad. They they have a lot of uh, they have a lot of fried meat. They have no fried fish, meat, lots of meat. It's like kebabs uh, on almost every single. Uh, lots of pastries. I mean, don't get me wrong. If you go to the really really nice restaurants, you're going to get a good meal. But the average person eats really badly here. Um, but it, the food is cheap, so you can't really complain about that. The food is very cheap. Um, another observation I have found about the former Yugoslavia in general, um, they're not fans of queuing. The amount of times I've had to be the Brits and say, look, the queue's back there, mate. It's, it's unbelievable. Um, so you need to go back and fill that in. And then make sure when you fill okay. in the facilitating form this to me. that you do photographs. I'm British. I know how to kill. Also, when you make way for someone on the pavement, then the pavements are very small here. Um, the observation I've noticed is no one's, no one says thank you. <laughs> There's a sort of a, no one really says, acknowledges a kind gesture I've noticed. Lynn, you, you're angry? You dirt tootin', I'm angry! I have never been this angry in my entire life! Hey, I feel great! I love being angry! Thank you, Stimpy. Happy to be of service? I know these are sounding like huge gripes, but... I, when you travel around the rest of the world and you notice people's general manners, I, I make note there's not many manners around here, but at the same time, it is a nice place. Uh, Montenegro, not bad bar. Uh, in terms of uh, observations on bad bar, if you're thinking about it and you're not some sort of overweight uh, Russian tourist who's about seven foot nine, who likes to wear speedos, I would avoid it. Um, but, you know, if you like cheesy music in the nightclubs, if you like uh, greasy food, grilled meat, uh, cheap, cheap food and cheap beer, then maybe this is your sort of place. But if you like a bit of culture, or if you like a, you know, a sort of nice town that isn't grimy, I don't, I'd say avoid Budva. Uh, head to Qatar, it is uh, so much but nicer. Something must have happened. It's not you, it's me. You're giving me the it's not you, it's me routine?
Now, don't misunderstand me. Um, Budvar, the old town, is very pretty, very beautiful, but it's actually really small. It's just a sort of, uh, it's a small little section of what Budvar really is. Um, this is basically the old town and it stretches three blocks one way and three or four blocks another way. Um, once you get past the old town, you just basically get into sort of brand new hotels and very, very old hotels and lots of little apartment blocks where they basically rent them out to tourists on mass demand and um, yeah, it's, it's like, it is Montenegro and Montenegro's Benidorm, ignoring this part because this is beautiful, this is very beautiful, but this is, like I say, three by four in terms of blocks. See, it's not that pretty the rest of it. See, kebabs everywhere. See the food is cheap. Yo, so I'm here um, at the bus station. Uh, usual sort of place to wait when you're traveling uh, around with a backpack. Um, there's the backpack. Um, yeah, I mean, you, see, you had you had my little rant earlier in regards to what I thought of Budva. Um, I mean, yeah, it's 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 a nighttime place, but it's so cheesy. Um, I, I, Honestly, there's a thousand places to visit over this one. Um, but next place, Albania. Join me there.